This is exercise 7-1-A using layers. We are in the floor plan drawing in the Steps Lesson 7 folder. We'll begin just by having a little practice with the layers in the layer control box. We'll pick the down arrow in the layers control box and we'll set the furniture layer current by selecting it. Notice that it now appears in the layer control box. Now anything that we draw will appear on the furniture layer. We'll draw a couple of, uh, couple of rectangles to complete the desks. I'm going to turn my snap on to make this a little faster. And you'll notice that these desks appear on the proper layer. Now we'll set the text layer current. Notice that the text layer is now current and we'll put a little text in our drawing. Notice that all of our text appears on the text layer. Now let's see what happens when we freeze the layer. I'll pick the down arrow on the layer control box and I'll go to the subwalls layer. Just to the left of the color button is a little snowflake. If I pick that, you'll notice that everything that was on the subwalls layer has disappeared. Let me show you another way to do that. First I'll thaw the layer by picking the snowflake again. and notice that my layers, notice that the items that are on that layer come back. If I don't know what layer something is on, I can pick this button up here, the freeze layer, and I can select an object that's on the layer that I want to freeze. Again, we can thaw the subwalls layer like so. Let's fix these subwalls that are on the wrong layer. Pick the layer match button AutoCAD asks to select something, select the objects that need to be changed. I'll select the subwalls that are on the wrong layer, like so. Hit enter, and now AutoCAD wants to know what's on the right layer. So I'll pick something on the right layer, and AutoCAD makes the adjustment for me. Let's see what happens when we lock a layer. We'll go to the Layers control box, go down to the, to the Walls layer, and pick the Lock button. Notice that the walls dimmed just a little bit to show me that they're locked. Now, suppose I wanted to erase, and I put a big crossing window around all of these items up here. Of course, some of the walls are included in that selection. But notice that they did not disappear, that I did not erase them because that layer was locked. Let's undo the erasure, like so, and we can save the drawing. 